I thought I'd throw my own little spin on it. What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Reset Running with Dave. This time I'm at the gym. So the reason I'm at the gym is I've seen on Instagram, I've seen like heaps of reels and a couple of YouTube shorts of the Kipchoge challenge. So I thought that I would come here, film it, and I thought I would throw my own little spin on it. So if you're not familiar with the Kipchoge challenge, basically you jump on a treadmill, you set it to 21 k's an hour um, or 13 miles an hour and you run for as long as you can, you time yourself and that's the, that's the challenge. But I thought, that would be pretty boring because I'd probably just be on there for like two minutes and that would be done and then that's not very exciting. So I thought I'd throw my own little spin on it. So basically what I'm going to do, I'm going to start off with 400 meters. Okay, then I'm going to have like a three minute rest or enough to recover um, and then to get into 800 meters and then try for 1200 meters and so on and just keep going until I fail. Going into this, I'm fairly confident I can do 400 meters. Um, well, I should be able to. 800 meters, honestly, I'm a little doubtful of myself, but I'm gonna stay, no, I need to be confident. I'm gonna, I can do 800 meters. I can do 100, 800 meters. Um, the 1200 meters, I'm extremely doubtful. So we'll see how that goes. All right, so now you guys know what the Kipchoge challenge is and I'll see you guys in the gym. Let's go. So while I'm warming up, I'll explain who Eluid Kipchoge is. So he's a Kenyan distance runner who is widely considered the world's greatest marathoner. Between 2014 and 2019, he won all 10 marathons he entered. Kipchoge holds the world record for the marathon, which is two hours, one minute and nine seconds. Running at an average speed of 21 kilometers per hour or two minutes, 52 seconds per kilometer, Kipchoge finished the race, shaving a full 30 seconds off his previous world record. All right, so let's get into our first round of 400 meters at 21 k's an hour. Barely made that. That was really hard. There's no way in hell I'm getting 800 meters. I only just made that. It's a bit of a fail. That's tough. That's tough. All right, so that was a massive fail. Well, I got it, but I'm not going to get 800 meters. Um, but I have a theory that that assault runner is a little bit harder than it had to be. So I've rigged up a regular treadmill to 21 k's. I'm gonna see if I can get 800 meters. It's not gonna be pretty. Um, legs are pretty heavy right now, but may as well. All right, wish me luck. Story. I actually ended up holding the pace. It felt way easier. The only thing, I don't know if you can see in the video, but my feet kept like sliding forward on the treadmill. Obviously not the best treadmill in the world to use, but held 21 k's an hour for the 800 meters. And yes, I factored in like the, the rolling at the start. Um, I don't know how Kipchoge does that for a marathon. He's an absolute beast, truly world class. Look, I don't think I'm going to try the 1200. I know I'm not going to get it, um, but we got here. I got the 800, surprised myself, stoked with that. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the car. Peace. All right, guys, we're back in the car. I'm going to say success and not success. 
Success as in, I got the 800 meters, which I was iffy about, but I'm stoked I got it. Not a success because, I don't know, did I cheat? Like I did 400 meters legit on that assault, right, uh, assault runner. There's no way in hell I would have got 800 meters. I felt like that was, I felt like five times harder than it should have been. So props to you if you do it. Um, but yeah, I, I encourage anybody to give this Kipchoge challenge a go, like my spin off of it. Um, if you do, and you do upload it, tag me. I wanna see, I wanna see how well you went. Um, and if anybody gets that 1200, then you guys are bloody good. All right, guys, I'm gonna leave it at that. I hope you enjoyed this Kipchoge challenge. Uh, I thought it'd be fun to film this and I did enjoy myself. I was probably, I literally paid 20 bucks to get in the gym just then. And I was probably in there for like 20 minutes worth it hopefully you guys like this video if you do like the video make sure you like it and if you're not a subscriber make sure you subscribe for future running content um and if you yeah if you like it share it with your running buddies um it really helps me out and as always guys have a reset mindset i'll see you guys next time peace